Hey everybody, it's Second Chance Adventures here. Um, today makes day number 46 after having gastric bypass surgery. Um, it's kind of a hard day today. Um, I don't really want to go into a whole lot of detail, but um, it was a little hard today. But I'm doing okay. Um, there was a few times throughout, during the day where I was feeling down because of what's going on, and I wanted to just go in the kitchen and gorge, or I wanted to, like, go to Subway or Taco Bell and gorge, but I had to stop myself, because one, it'll just be a waste of money, because I'm just going to puke it up, it's a waste of time, and then it'll just make me feel even worse, so don't let the hard times do that to you, because, you know, before surgery, you're so used to eating whatever you want, when you want, how much you want, for whatever reason, that sometimes it'll kind of creep back on you mentally and you'll want to just start doing those bad habits again but you know I'm alert I guess enough to know that you know it's not gonna work out so um, just know that whenever you have surgery it's going to really challenge you in a lot of ways, it's like having to make a whole new personality, a, a whole new decision-making mechanisms. Um, that's all I really have today. Um, I, I, the only thing I really had today was like a few slices of English cucumber. I just needed something because it had just been so long since I ate. I had to have something because my stomach was really starting to cramp because I just hadn't eaten so long. That'll happen too. You'll go X amount of days, full days without eating except just water. And then all of a sudden your stomach's knocking on you saying, Hey, have you forgotten about me? And it's not that you've forgotten about it. It's just you don't want to upset it or mess it up because it's still kind of raw after surgery. I mean, it's been a month and a half and it's still a bit raw. You know, and you don't want to injure yourself, which is the smart thing to do. You know, listen to the voice that says, don't do it. Um, because if you go back to your old habits, you're going to have so many regrets. You could mess up your surgery, stretch out your stomach, you could injure yourself. You know, and if you eat stuff you're not supposed to or too much of it, you're going to puke. You're going to have dumping syndrome. It's just not worth it. It's really not. So if you're having a bad day or something happens, just do something different. You know, go for a walk or read. I, I'm reading my Bible right now. I'm in the book of John. Um, you know, do whatever you have to do. Because food is no longer an option. It's not even an option when you need to eat, really. You know, so doing it because you're upset or angry or something is just... It's not going to happen. It's really not. I mean, you can, but it's just going to come right back out. And it'll just be a waste. Big, big waste. Well, anyways, um, that's all I have for today. Um, just know that you're going to have times where you're going to fight yourself and want to go eat because you're upset or angry or worried or whatever it is. But don't give in to it. Don't give in to it. Be strong. I have confidence in you. And until tomorrow, please take care of yourselves and do whatever you can to stay healthy. We have one body and one body only. So do what you can to keep it alive. If you need anything, let me know in the comments and I'll do what I can to help you. Till then, have a good rest of the evening. Bye.